Casey, this is Eric over there in Infinity of Kirkland. See if we can figure this out for you. All right, so I'm seeing it at JX now. I'm going to go through the process. If it doesn't work in this manner, it needs to come in for service. So I'm going to turn on the air conditioning system by pressing the auto button. The mode that it's in right now, both the auto system, the rear, and the recirculates all on. The first thing I'm going to do is hit rear to get that screen up. And then I'm going to press off. Now the auto system still stays on, the air conditioning system still stays on, but the rear vents are now completely off. If you still hear the noise coming out of the rear, be mindful that it could be the cooled seats working as well. So make sure that your cooled seats, if you have both heated and cooled seats on your unit, are turned into the off position. Now this particular unit I'm in only, actually it does have the both, I'm going to turn it to both off for both heated and cooled seats. So now even the compressors are not working. In addition to that, if you turn off the air conditioning system and you hear any noise at all, you hear any noise coming from any vent anywhere in the vehicle, it needs to be brought in for service. So again, if I turn off all my ACs, including by pressing rear, bringing up the screen, and pressing off, now that is off, and also pressing off on the main, that's off, and my rear seat, my, my seat uh, cooling system is off, meaning that the compressor is off, you should hear no noise, it should be a very quiet cabin at this point. If you hear any noise, we need to schedule you for service, feel free to give me a call or an email and we'll get you squared away. Alright Lacey, good hearing from you again and I hope that works out for you. Thanks, bye.